Hello, and welcome to Short Pan Tutorials. These are some of the exciting new features Palo Alto introduced in PanOS 9.1. Automatic Panorama Connection Recovery. If you commit a configuration change that causes the firewall to lose connection to Panorama, PanOS 9.1's hourly connectivity checks can trigger an automatic Panorama Connection Recovery to revert to the last burning configuration to restore its Panorama connection. Dynamic User Groups. To determine what users to include as members, a dynamic user group uses tags as filtering criteria. As soon as a user matches the tag, that user becomes a member of the dynamic user group. Static tags are part of the firewall configuration, while dynamic tags are part of the runtime configuration. As a result, you don't need to commit updates to dynamic tags if they are already associated with a policy that you have committed to the firewall. These tag-based groups can provide temporary access for users who need temporary privilege escalation. Streamlined application-based policy. You can now safely enable a broad set of applications with common attributes using a single policy rule. For example, you can now enable broad access for your users to web-based applications using the web app tag in an application filter. Palo Alto researches new and updated applications, groups those with common attributes, and delivers this through tags and content releases. You can also apply your own tags and create application filters based on those tags to address your own application security requirements. Enhanced logging for Global Protect. To help you monitor and troubleshoot issues with your Global Protect deployment, PanOS 9.1 now provides the following login enhancements. Global Protect activity charts and graphs on the Application Command Center displays a graphical representation of activity in your Global Protect deployment. Information includes the number of users and number of times users connected, the gateways to which users connected, the number of connection failures and failure reason, a summary of authentication methods and Global Protect app versions used, and the number of endpoints that are quarantined. New Global Protect log table displays Global Protect connection logs all in one place. Log forwarding of Global Protect logs to a third party receiver or ticketing system. Thank you for watching short PAN tutorials. Feel free to like and subscribe and to check out our business website linked down below.